Welcome to another episode of PSI Math series on ABCD. In today, we'll be going through episode number 34. In this PSI Math series, we'll be going through questions that PSI students might find it difficult to solve. Remember in our previous episode, we went through question 1 of worksheet 17. Today, we'll be going through question number 3. Just a side note, you'll be able to find the link to the Google Docs for this question in the description below. Now, let's get started. There are 170 Pikachus and Ratatas being released yesterday. Today, the number of Pikachus has been increased by one third and the number of Ratatas has been raised by 0.5 times. Given that there are an increased in good number of Pikachus and Ratatas being released today, find out A. How many Pikachus were being released yesterday? And B. What is the total number of Pokemons released today? So, similar to the previous question, we are going to draw the model. Okay, so in this case, we know that in the end, they will have the same number of, um, same number, they'll be equal, okay? Then, um, because this is one third, so this should have four units such that, um, if I repeat one of the units, then I will have the same number. Okay, so initially there is three units, so if I add in one third, which is equal to one unit, then I'll have four units, and four units will be equal to the final value in the today. Okay, this is how I calculated that. So initially got three units, one third of three units is one unit, so I have four units. Okay, then for the other case, initially have two units increased by half, so now I have three units. Then between three units and four units, I divide them into 12 units each to make sure that I'll be able to reference them together. Okay, so this is the amount that has been added. Initially three units, I in one more unit. Initially, two units, I had one more unit. So this though, after we move, I will have 170. Because these are today, these are what is yesterday. So with this, you will be able to calculate that 17 units of these small units will be equal to 170. Therefore, one unit equals to 10. Okay, then the initial P... Initial P will actually be equal to 9 units, therefore it's equal to 90. Then initial R will actually be equal to 8 units, so this is equal to 80. Then the new P will turn out to be... um Okay, you can use 12 units to get 120 or because initially it's 90, so you actually get... 4 over 3 times 90. This also gives you 120. New R. You can actually calculate as 12 units at 2 if you calculate manually. Or you can write 3 over 2 times 80. This also gives you 120. Okay? Then just note that um the value actually turns out to be the same. So this means that Today, both have equal number of Pokemon, uh, equal number of Pikachu and Ratatas being released today. Then, if I add these two together, I will get two hundred and forty. Okay. So basically, the numbers of Pikachu being released yesterday will be equal to ninety, and the total number of Pikachu that were released today, the number total number of Pokemon that were released today is two hundred and forty. Okay, the question that we just went through is question 3 of worksheet 17. There's two more questions available. Okay, this is question 1. The solution for question 1 is um, 700 and 1120 respectively. If you need the solution for this question, feel free to browse our previous episode. Then, this is question 2. The solution is 108 for both. Oh, I said uh, 104. 
108 for both. Okay? Mm. So, in the meantime, feel free to drop us an email if you've got any challenging questions. You also welcome feedbacks and comments. Our contact details are in the description below. That's the end of this video. Thank you for watching. We hope that you have learned this concept. And here's Miss J signing off. Bye-bye!